What's up everybody and welcome back for another streaming tip video. Today we're going to be downloading these free streamer layers from Nerd or Die and I'm going to show you how to set up in Twitch and OBS. Let's jump into it. So the first thing I want you to do is head on over to Nerd or Die. I'll leave the link down below in the description. Scroll down to stream alerts. From here you want to scroll down a bit more. Click on page 2. And here we have a fireworks stream and there's package free. So click on that. Add the cart. Once that's added the cart, you want to go ahead and check out there and you want to create an account for free. Once you've created your account, these will be available to download absolutely free and you can download them to your designated folder on your PC. Okay, so the next step I want you to do is head on over to your Twitch page and click on create a dashboard. Once you're over here, click on alert on the left hand side. Create an alert box and from here we can see on the left hand side some alerts that have already been created by Twitch but we're going to change the animation in this and we're going to disable a couple of the alerts that we're not going to use. So I'm not going to use the alert goal, the channel points are going to disable, hype train I'm going to leave as is, as you can see it's a pretty cool animation. So charity I'm going to disable because we're not using that at the minute. raid i'm going to leave raid as it is because we haven't got one to change at the moment so we're going to change new follower subscriptions gifted subscriptions and cheering so click on your new follower general settings we want to change that to five because 10 is pretty long we're going to leave the animations as it is but you can actually change these here click on layout i want that text to be in the center of the screen and then i'm going to drop shadow Text to speech, I'm going to leave that as it is. And what I'm going to do is change the text color. So I'll scroll over here. I'm going to change it to a nice green to match my channel. I'm going to drop shadow. Actually, I'm going to disable drop shadow on that animation because we don't need it. Visuals and sound. And here we're going to upload one of the files we've downloaded from there to die. So I'll click on upload file. I'm going to change that to yellow short for it works. So click on that. I'm going to leave the sound alert as it is, but you can also change that in the sound library that Twitch have already provided. Or else, if you have your own sound alerts, you can upload here also. So click down here, click save, and then we're going to preview the alert as well. So we're going to preview it here. There we go. And that sound alert actually works pretty well with this. So click on subscriptions. This is the next one we're going to do. And but just before we do, we're going to copy that hex code over here. Prime subscription. We're going to follow what we've just done previously. So we're going to change that to five. Center the text. Change that color. Just copy in the hex code. Upload file change that to blue and you can just change you can just change whatever color that you want as well so let me see we're gonna say drop shadow on that as well remember that and then what you want to do is click save and preview alert then so we're going to do this for the resub and a new subscriber also we'll do it quickly here so five center the text copy the Hex code, upload file, change to green, okay. And then we're gonna drop shadow as well. Click save. New subscriber. Center the text. Paste in the code. Pin. Drop shadow, upload file, purple, click OK, and then save changes. We're going to do the gifted subscription as well. So let's click on here. Change that. Center the text. Upload a file, click on red, ok, 
10 seconds, 5 seconds, click save. Set the text. Click shadow. Open the file. Click red again. Give you alert. Gonna leave the charting as is, but we're going to change the font color. Save. Raid, we're going to leave as it is and we're going to change the font color. Click save. You want to change the duration of these as well, also. So, five, no, that's eight, five, that's two, no, five. Click save. Five, save. Pipe train. Change that. Click on five. Change the color to five. Give you a test. So the next step you want to do is copy the URL on the bottom right hand corner and then we're going to open OBS and we're going to paste our source into OBS. So once you're in OBS you want to click on the plus sign, click on browser, click alerts, click OK, copy in and it's going to be 1920 by 1080p and you want to control that audio via OBS as well because we know that there's sound alerts on that as well so click OK and then I'm just going to control F to stretch that out because my monitor is 1440p and then we're going to do the same here I'm going to copy that so you can actually copy Control C or just copy like that. The rest. And you want to make sure that the alerts are above all you're seeing because you want that to stand out more. You don't want to be in the background. So we're going to actually test this over here now. So I'm going to click on follower and then send test alert. And there we can see it popping up straight away. And then we're going to click on a prime subscription and click send test alert as well to see does that work that works fine gifted subscriptions you see send test alert there we go everything is working fine and this is a great way to stand out from the rest of the crowd that are already using the twitch generic alerts and it only takes a couple of minutes and they're totally free to use and keep an eye out on nerd or die because they do free overlays free alert packages as well so it's well worth checking them out every now and again well that's it for this video and send up your own stream alerts in twitch and obs if you found it helpful don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content below until next time keep creating and i'll catch you in the next one Bye bye